We've had this conversation and you seem to agree with me But when there's complications, you withdraw and leave me to be When there's a problem, you become like a wall And every time I trip, it's a free We are starting it off today with a lower body workout from my dumbbell only 12 week workout challenge. And as you can see here, I'm starting off with a dynamic warm up and some activation exercises. This is a great way to bring blood flow to the muscles as well as open up our hips and get our glutes to fire. With all of my workouts in my workout challenge, everything I do have linked for you guys with full videos of me doing the exercises. I am starting it off with this lateral lunge to RDL movement. And I truly love to get creative with all my workout programs. And I love to just get away from squats. So many people work in that frontal plane and it's getting into the laterals, activating our hamstrings, our glutes, and challenging our stability and strength as well. This exercise is one of my favorites for your hamstrings and glutes, and I superset it with hip thrusts on the stability ball until failure, and my legs were firing. But if you guys would like to join my 12-week at home slash dumbbell homely workout program you guys can head over to the description i'm giving you a coupon for the next 24 hours to save ten dollars and if you're a beginner if you're advanced you could make gains on this program i mean build muscle lose fat i'm excited to be doing it with you i'm a few weeks in now and i'm feeling muscles fire and sore like never before Welcome back to another vlog. So it is Saturday. I have a full day filled for you guys with food, my favorite recipes, a day in the life. We got filming, family workouts, and so much more. So as you guys can see, I woke up early today. I got in my workout. For all of you guys doing my at-home challenge, I missed Friday's workout. I took it off. My body just needed a day of rest. So I moved my workout to today and kind of just took yesterday as a little recovery day. You always have to listen to your body. So right now, what I'm doing is I am prepping my lunchbox. I'm gonna be gone for the entire day. So I wanna share with you guys my top tips of how to pack food with you, everything that I do to stay on track when I'm gonna be gone for the entire day. Before I do a rundown of everything I pack in my lunchbox, if you haven't saw my video yet on my game changer hacks when it comes to packing your lunchbox to stay on track, go check out that video. So here's the deal. I have my whole day structured. I started off this morning, I did my element electrolytes, um, and then I have my reds, my greens, my creatine, and then my post-workout shake in here, which is my ignition and my vegan plant-based protein. So I don't skip breakfast. I'm gonna be drinking this on my hour drive to my family's house because I wanna make sure I'm getting the protein, the carbs to replenish my glycogen levels so that I'm fueling my body and not breaking down my own muscle fibers since I'm gonna continue to train. So I got this to drink. If you guys ever have any questions about supplements, feel free to send me over an email. Um, I also do a monthly giveaway. If you guys ever use my support link, make sure you're filling out that giveaway form because I give, I give back to you guys every month a free supplement and I just, I love, I love giving back to you guys for supporting me. So first thing, invest in a good lunch box. I have a Yeti, this thing keeps things cold four hours, love it. So what I'm doing is I order all of my meat in bulk and I always save the little freezy packs because I use these when I'm traveling on airplanes because they don't liquefy fast and you can bring them on and when I'm going to put them in my lunch box. So I'm gonna be throwing this in here now. For breakfast, carb, fat, and protein, I'm gonna be making my creamy rice bowl. So I'm gonna be bringing with me my favorite rice and I'm gonna be sharing all the recipes with you guys. Um, I already packed my protein powder in my Ziploc bag that I have in here. I'm bringing with me my cinnamon and then I'm gonna be putting my coconut oil into a little Ziploc bag to bring with me as my healthy fat source. 
My family already has some nuts, some seeds, some berries at their house, so I'm not bringing those with me today. Now, for lunch, I know that I need a protein, I need a fat, I need a carb, I wanna keep it simple. So I'm bringing with me red potatoes. Then, um, this is my favorite, I love the white pastures. This is ground chicken. I'm gonna be individually putting four ounces of this into a Ziploc bag throwing it in my lunchbox so I can easily just throw it in the oven with my potatoes when I'm at my family's house. And then I'm just gonna use whatever greens that they have. And then in terms of my supplements, there's a few things that I just need, I need with my meals. They make me feel good. So the two things that I'm gonna, three things I'm gonna be bringing with me are my digestive enzymes and my GI advantage. And if you guys don't know, I used to have 15 types of parasites, H. pylori, SIBO, these have been game changer. The GI Advantage is like a mix of all of your demulcent herbs and L-glutamine. So it's go-to for bringing down inflammation in the gut, healing and sealing the gut lining. It makes my stomach feel good. So I'm going to be putting that in my pill container. And then my enzymes, I do two of these every meal to help break down my food, absorption and assimilation. This has helped me a lot with gas, bloating. And then my daily multivitamin, I think I opened it on accident. Oops, <laughs> let me grab that. My daily multivitamin, multimineral probiotic. So I take this every day. I'm packing these with me. And then we are heading out. I just keep it simple. And yeah, let's go. Let's go to the family's house. I got to go grab Tank and we are headed out.
Come here. Bat time. <laughs> it's bat time. Say hi, Grandpa. <gasps> for a recipe it is time for breakfast we just wrapped up filming it's around it's 10 20 here so you guys kind of see the way i have my days structured in terms of getting my electrolytes making sure i'm prioritizing pre and post-workout nutrition because i'm burning through calories i am training hard i am over here doing my challenge i'm recording content and it's so important to make sure you are fueling your body properly so I am making my protein packed cream of rice. It tastes delicious. And I am so, so, so excited to share the recipe with you guys. So I'm going to be taking you guys through. So first off, I make my own cream of rice. I buy the Lotus Foods. This is my favorite rice. And I'm just going to put it in the coffee grinder into little grits and cook it just like I would any type of cream of rice. Then what I'm going to be doing is adding one scoop of my vanilla vegan protein. Um, you guys know this is my favorite protein. It's the only one that doesn't cause bloating for me. And I'll put my support link in the description for you guys. I'm going to be throwing in some cinnamon. I love cinnamon. Also, it's great to stabilize your blood sugar levels. And then what I'm going to top that with is some blueberries for healthy antioxidants some pistachios these are my favorite for that crunch factor healthy fats and then i know i brought my coconut oil in a ziploc bag but i'm gonna do melted coconut oil on top so you guys see with this breakfast i'm gonna be getting a carb fat and protein to stabilize blood sugar levels and it's gonna be around 70 grams of carbohydrates 30 grams of protein with the nuts and the protein powder, and then around 20 grams of fat. So it's a good, good meal to keep me satiated, keep me feel, feeling full, and help me recover from all of the training that I've been doing. So I'm ready. I'm going to go make my cream of rice. Let's do this. Coffee cups and cigarettes laying around the room. I don't mind a little mess. Just want to stay with you. And we'll... All right, so it doesn't look like much, but it tastes so good. So I have in here my cinnamon, my coconut oil. I just washed this whole pint of blueberries and I'm going to throw them on top. But it's just it hits that sweet spot. That oh, and let me know, do you guys make any cream of rice concoctions yourself? What's your favorite breakfast meal? Put it in the comments below. I would love some recipe ideas. <laughs> So you guys saw earlier, I packed my little pill case. I love this thing. I always keep it in my bag with me. Um, I have my digestive enzymes in here, my GI advantage and my microfactor. And these are the three things I take every day. So digestive enzymes break down your food into smaller particles. They have helped me so much with gas, bloating. Um, I used to have 15 types of parasites, H. pylori, and I used to feel like my food would sit in my stomach. And these have been game changer for just making me feel lighter in my stomach. I feel like I'm absorbing and assimilating my nutrients better. 
Um, the GI Advantage is the one that I put in my video, and I'll put my whole leaky gut video for you guys, but it has all the demulcent herbs in there, the marshmallow, the DGL, aloe, glutamine, everything to heal and seal that gut lining. Um, I used to have a lot of um, leaky gut, food allergies, food sensitivities, and this helps just a lot, just bowel regularity, guys, bringing down the inflammation. And then Microfactor has all my micronutrients in it, antioxidants, probiotics. It's my one-stop shop, multivitamin, multimineral. So keep them in the go. I'm going to take these and then go enjoy my breakfast. Hope you guys are enjoying the vlog. Today we decided to head over to the farmer's market. This is one of my favorite things to do on Saturdays. I used to do it in LA and me and my dad have been having this Saturday routine for the last few weeks and it's just, it's been so nice. He loves these salsa and everything here. Of course, I go toward all the vegetables and I'm like, I want the coconut, the coconut meat. And he's like, I want the Wahoo dip. But it's just been so much fun and something I'm truly grateful for having my family around. So I ended up staying a lot later. So of course I prepped ahead and I brought more food. So I am making up some food right now. I'm going to show you guys. So I'm just roasting up some red potatoes. I got some chicken. I'm going to break out some spices, some greens and see what else my parents have in the oven. But it's just keep it super simple. I'm just not going and trying to make crazy meals. I got my carb, my protein, my fat and like on times like this, I just wanted to bring something with me that was easy food that made me feel good and just simplicity, guys. I want to be daring, baby, dance the night away. I let my head down if I want. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and be? I'm gonna be wrapping off the vlog here. I wanna finish with two little things. Um, first off, um, I've been getting a lot of questions about my at-home workout program. If you guys wanna join, you can join anytime, anywhere. You just need a set of dumbbells. I'll put all the details below. I'm doing it right now and I'm having so much fun and truly just feeling muscles fire like never before. I have a hard time getting sore and the lower body day from the first training split walking like a duck the next day. So if you guys wanna join me, it is not too late. I will put the info below and never hesitate to ask any questions about anything in terms of like the program, what it is, all that. So second thing is I wanna thank you guys so much for all of your support on my journey. Thank you so much for watching this today. And if you guys would like to see more vlogs, just let me know. Sending so much love. We will see you next week. Make sure to subscribe, subscribe for Tank. Share this with a friend and let's get feeling our best self this year together. Love you guys.